Hey guys, and welcome back. This is Zach here, and today we're going to be playing Doom. Brutal Doom, that is. This is the probably the most well-known mod of Doom, and it is amazing. So, right from the get-go, the menu's different. Normal, we're going to start with the rifle, which is a new weapon. Uh, obviously, need deep in the dead, and we're going to play on ultraviolence, because there's a bunch of options here, like realism and stuff. I haven't touched those yet, but we're going to do ultraviolence, because... I only play Doom on Ultra Violence or a higher difficulty at this point in my life. So let's just jump right into it, guys. Okay, so right from the get-go, you're going to notice I got a rifle instead of a pistol. And basically, Brutal Doom takes the game and brings it into, like, the 21st century, I guess you could say. Shotgun's the best. And it basically makes the game a lot gorier. Um, the weapons reload, obviously. As you can see, I can reload my weapons. Um, texture updates. Uh... Enemy AI, enemy AI has been approved a lot more blood. Like, guys, this, this is going to get intense really, really fast. Like, as you can see, there's, like, a bunch of animations. Look at that. He just flew onto that. Like, did you see that? That was awesome. Oh, yeah. Sometimes enemies drop items. Let's keep moving. Yeah, so... Plus, in this mod, like, everything just moves a lot faster. Everything's happening much quicker. It's just amazing. Oh, oh. oh, yeah. One of the new weapons in Brutal Doom. The Uzi. Very cool. Very nice. There are a couple of new enemies, some new weapons. Um, there's even a hatchet, which is just awesome. Oh, when barrels explode, they explode. Alright, so I think we're pretty much good to go. Well, I should probably go back and get the shotgun ammo from that secret area. Let's go back and do that. There we go. Much better. Alright. Let's equip that shotgun. Let's get out of here. Obviously, it's only the first level. It's not really that difficult, even on ultra violence. There we go. But this gets really intense. I mean, look at that. Look at that animation. Oh, I blew his hat off. What else can I do to him? That's it, I think. That's right, so one hanger onward to level two, the nuclear plant. Like this mod is just incredible. Now, just to clarify, um, the version I'm playing of Brutal Doom since it's gone through revisions. This game, this has been being worked on for years. Uh, this is pretty much the final version of Brutal Doom. I think this version came out like early this year, and the guy who made it basically said, you know, I'm pretty much done with it. It's over. I'll probably do some. Whoa. Ran out of ammo. I'll probably do some bug fixes, but this is pretty much Brutal Doom in its final form. So, I actually haven't touched this mod in probably like four years. So it's cool to come back to it, seeing it fully finished, and just... God, it's so good. This, this is like its own game. Like, this should be released on the consoles for everyone to play. It's a shame that you have to like, you know, mod it yourself and get it all set up. That guy was easy. Alright, let's go outside. Oh yeah, Soul Sphere. Gotta have it in Brutal Doom. You guys suck. And of course, the crowning jewel, the chain gun. You thought the chain gun was awesome in the original Doom? This thing is gonna blow enemies away. Wait till you see this thing in action. It's truly amazing. Let's go try it out on some poor soul in here. Perfect. Oh! You see that? Oh! Piece of cake. Little ammo from the chain gun. Why not? I don't really need to go in there. Just a couple things. As you can see, I could pretty much just destroy everything in my path without too much trouble. Let's go down here. Oh! Ooh, don't want to be taking direct hits in ultra violence mode. I'll get, I'll get my ass handed to me. All right, let's finish up this level. Whoa! Whoa! Okay. Oh, I lost my soul sphere health. Oh well. Nope. Don't think so, buddy. All right, onward to level three, guys. The toxic refinery. One of my favorite levels in terms of design and layout. 
Oh, we're going to see the pink demons in this level. Yep, there's an invisible one. Oh, you see the smoke come off that? That was awesome. There you go. Oof, on the roof. Nasty. Oop. I don't think so, buddy. Ooh, I'm kind of running low on ammo. Whoa! Did not see him. Oh, yeah, they dropped the invisible things. How cool is that? There we go. Nope, don't think so, guys. There we go. I made quick work of them. Just some more shotgun ammo. I'll switch back to the shotgun for a bit. Ooh. Oh, oh, got to reload. That's a good call. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, got a pink demon. Oh, look at that. You can shoot off a piece of his body and he still chases you. That is so awesome. It's like, and the thing about this mod is, it's the little details that really get to me. And how much hard work was put into this. Oof. I think actually... Because I did a Let's Play of Doom 64. I think there is a brutal Doom 64, and I am going to check that out as soon as I finish this Let's Play. Because I do love Doom 64. I do have a Let's Play of it, so you should go over and watch it. It's quite cool. But yeah, I think that's everybody in here. we got to get to the secret. Whoa! Anybody left? Yep, yep, another one. I think that's everyone. Alright, let's get the soul sphere. I'm gonna need it. Since I'm guessing we're gonna go to the secret level. Oh! Yeah, to get to the secret level, we gotta go this way. Don't think so, buddy. Oh, look at that. Oof. There we go. Everyone's. Oh! I got the. Oh, I got the grenade launcher. I forgot that's a thing. Yeah, there's a grenade launcher in Brutal Doom. We'll try it out in a bit. Grab that backpack. Right, that'll open up the way to the secret level. Got the armor. Let's go. Now, there's a really cool feature um, in Brutal Doom that I just discovered last night. Oh, we're going to get to it in a second, but it is amazing. Truly incredible. Oh, yeah, I so said we're going to try the grenade launcher. Let's try it out. Where is it at? There it is. We've got 22 bullets. Let's try it out. Oh my god! Oh, I missed. There we go. Oh, guys, are you seeing this? It's just amazing. Look at the blood dripping from the... Jesus. It's like... Oh! Oh, I just killed myself. I did... Wait, can I get back up? No, I just did that. Yeah, there's no way back up. I'm dead. I melted. All right, guys, we're gonna jump back to where we were at. Give me a second. Sorry about that, guys. I got so excited with the grenade launcher. I fell into the the lava of death, the toxic poison. How foolish of me. So let's continue. So, yep, don't think so, buddy. Oh shit. Oh god, you're still alive. How'd you take so many bullets? Yeah, a little room full of enemies about to open up. Goodbye. That was cool. Let's keep moving up the red key card. Now that thing I was telling you about, that little secret new feature in Brutal Doom that is so epic, it's gonna blow you away. Well, it's coming right up right now. It's gonna get to it real quick. So in the yellow door in this level, which is basically an optional door. Oh shit. Ooh, no you don't. the chainsaw all right so in this yellow door we're gonna get a teammate yep we now have a friendly who's gonna has a plasma rifle and is gonna help us out how cool is that yeah he just wiped the floor with everybody <laughs> all right guys this is my new buddy uh, we're gonna call him Steve hi Steve 
So guys, we're going to stop here. When we come back, Steve and I are going to continue this quest, and I will see you guys real soon. Thanks for watching, and if you're enjoying this, please like and subscribe because every bit helps. All right, see you guys.